everyone welcome to blueberry production blueberries here and i have a big apology to make okay my first actually last six weeks like six weeks ago i didn't post a video i only posted a video twice so now it's another three weeks and now i didn't make a video i am so sorry y'all i just had problems with school and i was doing the play so i'd stay after school every wednesdays you know, stuff just jammed up and I just couldn't work well. And now I'm home on Saturday. It's time for me to chill out. And I was like, God, Blueberry Production needs a lot of work. So I decided to pop up with this big idea. So um, let's just say I'm being really busy and really tired. But I still have faith. And today you actually see the video. So congratulations to Faith and to me. And I'm really sorry also for a person who actually told me to give him a shout out. I'm sorry I didn't give you a shout out because I was really busy. But don't worry now. I'll post the video today and tomorrow just to break up the shield. And then I'll try my best to post on Wednesday and next week. I'll try hard. But before I keep jabbering, please play my intro. So, um, today, because I had delays in school and, like, I've been just taking my backpack, I just dressed up, take my backpack, and run out the door thinking of nothing to eat. I don't actually eat breakfast in school because, you know, it's school. What they give us in school is not that good. But I decided to show you guys some good breakfast food that y'all can actually eat when you're, like, in the bus or on the way to the bus stop. Because I go out, like... 20 minutes early because I really don't want to miss the bus. I'm like those kind of girls who like rush out the door and just jam at the door. Okay, so still talking. So I have here six, almost part of seven. I have six kind of foods that you guys can do. I think some of them, maybe it's just five, but I'm just gonna say six. I have six different healthy food for school. And still, I did not memorize it, again, because I had to memorize the play. But I quit the play because of Blueberry Production, and also I quit the play because I had problems in my classwork. And I also quit the play because I'm now a new goalie, so y'all welcome the new goalie of Hastings Night Great Center. And I am just going to show you. So let's just pop up to the first healthy food school, I mean food for school. My language these days. It's really Number one, brown bread and butter. Butter, butter. So, um, the best thing my mom does every day, she when she goes to the when she goes to H E B, she asks me, Do you want plain bread or brown bread? And I'll be like, Mom, you know what I'll choose? I'll choose brown bread. I I I love brown bread. I love all kinds of bread, but mostly brown. So I just wake up in the morning, take the brown bread, put it down in it, add butter, slap it on there, close it, out the door. It's easy, fast, as long as like you have all the ingredients set up on the table the night before you like, I mean the night before school, you're done, just on the table, and then when you come outside, just slap everything on the bread, close it, and you're out the door with your breakfast. That's good, because I did that, I did that actually last week, and I got to school as fast as possible, so it's good. Number two. Fried eggs. So, you know, you can't actually wake up in the morning and just start frying eggs like that. It's gonna burn. Okay, yes. But it's better. This is a quick life hack and tip for y'all who just wake up and out the door with food, whatever you find on the table, out the door. This actually will help you. So, I kind of like a life hack about frying eggs. So, when you wake up in the morning, switch off your alarm and just go straight to the kitchen. Um, crack an egg and add your flavoring and just smack it into the microwave but make sure uh, put oil on the plate before you actually crack the egg in it so put oil in the plate like all over the plate crack an egg add your seasoning mix it together and then smack it in the microwave and switch it on and then while you are dressing up that will be cooking and then you know the microwave timer will stop so it will stop the go so it's done so when it stops just take it out and you may like put it in a, even like you can put it in a little takeaway bag. Just rub it in the bag, smash everything there, and put it in the microwave, open, 
take it out as fast as possible and you just spend like three seconds in the kitchen except when you wake up but you still put it number three tea or cup of coffee because i am now well i love coffee i have been drinking french 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 vanilla god have mercy on my english i've been drinking french vanilla in school because i'm a librarian and give free coffee so um Actually, French vanilla is a cappuccino, but I love it. But I drink coffee, so what I do again is kind of like, like, like the last one. Wake up in the morning, put everything in the just like do this overnight. Put the um, if you have a coffee a coffee maker. God, in my English, Jesus. If you have a coffee maker, just put everything in the coffee maker and do not switch it on. And then the next morning, all you have to do is go there and switch it on while you're taking a bath. And then when you come outside, it'll be done. So you just take, just keep it there and wait for you to be finished. When it's time to go, you just take it, pour it in the cup, close the cup, out. That's it, as fast as possible. I do this because, y'all, on Monday, I'm really sleepy. Because, number one, on Sundays, I do not sleep good. Let's just say, I sleep late. And on Monday is a sad day for every ninth grader because you just get in class and be like, whoa, we got work. Why? Because on Friday, everyone be like, y'all, it's the weekends. Draw your smash your stuff. And then when you come on Monday, you realize, God, where did I keep this? And that's it. You get a problem. And you get in fail class. But I do not do that. I keep my stuff in a particular. God in my English. I'm tired of this English stuff. I wish I could speak my language frequently. English. Next. Number four. Have a PB&J sandwich. So, just... Do it again. Smack it in and just actually a PB and J sandwich you can buy though. So the best thing to do is buy a box of these and then just smack it in the fridge. And then when it's time for you to eat it, smack it in the microwave. On it, take a bath, it stops, you get out, take it out. Almost like everything. And then number five, it's like make any kind of sandwiches. But the best thing to do is to make those the night before you do this. Cause if you actually wake up in the morning, you have to make sure it's perfect, which is not going to happen because you're in a rush. Trust me, I've tried that. It didn't work. It was horrible. Horrible. Especially with my hair. I was all messed up. My hair was all over my face, and I was trying to just make a good sandwich, and my hair was in the sandwich with mustard and ketchup. Yes, mustard and ketchup. Next is have chocolate milk or any normal milk. Any milk. Any kind of milk. Chocolate milk, you can have normal milk, you can have 95% stuffed milk, blah blah blah. But I still don't care. Just have milk, just to like wake you up. Just have something to wake you up. And I think that's gonna help me. So guys, um that's all I have for today. Just like a few minutes. Not even wasting your time. I guess this video is gonna be like 10 minutes long. But before I leave this beautiful channel that y'all have been waiting for me to make a video, I would like to go back into, I'm going back into the shout outs because y'all, I got a shout out again from someone. Thank you very much for writing your name in the description below. Now I just open the page and check the shout outs. So I always write the shout outs right here in this page. Papers. So now for shout out. The shout out goes to Antivirus Manny or Bluefoot. So, because I cannot pronounce this very well, this will all be showing pop rock right there. So, make sure y'all check this out. Check his channel out. I think he has a channel. Just check it out. Check him out. And thank you guys. Make sure you give his um, shout out um, sentence or like his own. Um, what am I doing with English these days? Just check his comment and give it a thumbs up just to like support him. Niggas are wondering what's this on my hand. Stickers, I put like stickers on my hands. They say, in what? What does that say? Oh, it's upside down. It says, the dance is in me. So, frick shit. The dance is in me. I just had stickers on my body. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't want to waste 10 minutes of your life. Thanks y'all for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Give it a big thumbs up. And make sure you stay very delicious because Blueberry is here. And mostly, make sure you guys give um, subscribe to my second channel and my best friend's channel. That will be linked in the description below. And yeah, Blueberry is out. Bye-bye.